Hey guys, uh, welcome back to The Last of Us Part 2. We just stole the boat from the mall, um, which was a complete pain in the ass. We're on our way to the aquarium, so let's just keep going. Hell yeah, I'll take that. Uh, how's my machete doing? One sec. I guess I can't see that. Um, let's just swap it really quick because I don't remember. Okay, I guess. Can I fix it? No. So let's go ahead and take the pipe. Yeah, it won't get going. Go through. Let's have a look around real quick. Should be a good amount of stuff here. So it's been a few weeks since I've played, um, and I'm trying to get readjusted. It's been a while, so uh, let's read this real quick. Uh, cephalo, cephalopod, or cephalopod. I guess. Long thought to be a myth passed down through superstitious sailors, this extra-dimensional entity has taken on the form of a gargantuan, bioluminescent squid. Hiding from others of his kind, this hyper-intelligent being has taken a liking to our seas and the diverse life forms living within them. Unfortunately, Cephalophod has taken a temper to match its smarts. Conducting acts of tentacle-based terrorism against f fishing vessels, oil tankers, and other sea craft, which it believes are part of the cycle of harm against the world's oceans. Our only hope might be Big Blue. I like that. Tentacle-based terrorism. Let's grab some goodies. Keep looking, Ellie. Beth, if you're reading this, then I'm toast. I hope it wasn't those scar fuckers, but some blaze of glory. Bigger hope is you remember where we hid the stash. The code is 701264. It's not much, but it's all I have. I want you to take it. Be well, Randall. Oh, uh, that's right. It's the, um... I guess it's a door. Here you are. What did you... What did you put in here? Abby, I begged you to stop. You brought this on yourself. Pretty confident. I'll take this back. I think it's a little bit better. A little bit more sturdy. Okay. Where's this go? Alright, one more look at the code. Seventy twelve sixty four. Yeah, 
let's do a bit of reloading really quick. I'd be like totally scared of this thing just tipping over, going down those things, going down those little rapids. Have a look over here. Ugh. Hope you're grabbing all the stuff on like what you're doing in the mall area. Just like she would not pick stuff up underwater for some reason. I was getting really frustrated. <laughs> How much here? So we'll look at this real quick. Okay. Let's go. I don't think there's anything back in here, but Take a quick look and then get out. Yeah, I didn't think so. There's stuff in here though. Hmm. Oh, that's something we can do too. We can check out her pill situation. If any wolves read this, warn Isaac and the others. The rumors are true. There's a new infected out there. Looks like something made it halfway into a bloater and took a turn. Ugly motherfucker. Maybe all the rain around here caused the mutation? No idea. It was slow, so I put it down easy, but when I went to check it out, all these pustules on it exploded. Whole right side of my body is burned. Some kind of acid. If you see one of these things shambling towards you, stay back. God damn. Oh shit. Wow. I don't think I've ever had the WLF like taking pot shots at me from here. That's kind of crazy. Hoping they just take care of each other. Looks like they took care of him though. Misha, got word that you're replacing me. Wanted to give you a few pointers about this nest. One, the, scar, the scars are sneaky bastards. Don't just watch the street, check the rooftops. They got their own sharpshooters. Keep the infected alive. When the scars cross, they have to deal with them. Once they reveal their positions, take them out. Took out a pair of cultists, and I am now watching the infected devour their bodies. It's fucking glorious. And remember, don't get cornered. May your survival be long and your death be swift. Beck. Alright, 
let's take some uh, pot shots at these guys. Okay, I need you to turn around, Ellie. Oh, come on. Thank you. I need just these two. Okay, there's a couple up here. Last one, or I probably just go down and get him because I feel like he's just gonna see me. Yeah, I think I want to one more shot with that, so I don't want to completely waste it. I think that's all I think he's the last one for sure Oh shit, that was close. And you're going way in here. Hopefully he's the last one. Yeah. Right. Okay, cool. Let's have a quick look around. Cool. Take this too. Thank you. something 
No, let's go get the bow and we'll check out this little like secret place really quick. Actually, let's check out the boat too. Because there might be something over here with the wolves. Hopefully. Yeah. Okay, cool. Hell yeah. I think that's it though. It's kind of, it's kind of like park the boat in here and take a one more look around. Um, Cause I didn't check this little back area. So we'll do that. So I'm gonna be a hundred percent sure I don't have, or that I have everything I need. Perfect, thank you. Some of this looks like it should be something, but I guess it's not. Alright, let's go. What? Of course. Would have been too easy. WNB Arcade's Annual Fright Nights. Anyone in costume gets 100 tickets free. Special rewards on Halloween night, edible horrors, most beautiful costume contests, spectacular prizes. September 20th to October 31st, 8 p.m. to midnight. Oh, ski ball, I wanna play ski ball. Nothing in here? God damn. Oh, shit, so fucked up. Um, I'm gonna take the, mach the machete. for me. Shit. We already got that. Okay. Um, oh, God damn it. Let's do capacity for this because I got a lot more ammunition than I thought I would. probably all we can afford, so let's get out of here. I used to love playing this basketball game. Oh, it's parked here. Shit. <laughs> Go for smash. craft a few things because I think I know what's coming. Um, let's look at pills first actually. Instability increase. I 
think that's good. Um, yeah, okay. Oh my goodness. Getting stuck on everything. God damn. Shit is nasty, dude. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Come on, keep burning. Oh shit! <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck. God damn it. Probably stupid. Well, maybe not. That works. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Kill him. Oh my god. Big boy's dead. Fuck off. Jesus, man. And you don't get anything from that. Ah. Okay. Back to that damn Ferris wheel. Is that bright? 
home planet Titan. Orphaned by the civil war on Titan, young Kazak Bray vowed revenge on the future alliance, whom he held responsible for initiating the conflict. Growing up to become a renowned communication engineer for Spark Century 22, he developed quantum signaling technology that allowed for instant communication across vast distances. Though it gave Spark an advantage, they still suffered defeat after defeat against the future alliance. Boosting his quantum communicator to reach far beyond our star system, Kazak now tries to contact someone, or something, capable of helping him seek his revenge, neutral villain. Is that it? Okay. Yeah, they don't even want to give me candy here. Let's get out of here. Oh, okay, I'm like on a completely different side, so let's have a look over here. There's gotta be something, right? A little game area with jewels. I can't breathe. The horror of it all. We stopped in this derelict building for some last minute supplies before we were attacked by a large demon. It was reaching for me when Zachary leaped in front of it, hacking away at it with his hatchet. The demon grabbed him by the face and ripped his head in two. I knew he was gone, and I ran. I'm not a coward. There was no other way. By myself now, I must continue this journey to its end. I will make it to the island and join my new brothers and sisters. I will find Zachary's parents and honor his name. Jules, I suspect our paths will never cross again. I will pray for your soul. Goodbye, my friend. Emmett. There's something on the other side. Oh, Jules. So, I think I missed... A, um, a note in the damn building with the, the drawing where the wolves and the uh, scars are fighting and like the sniper's nest and all that stuff. I'm pretty sure I missed something there, which kind of sucks, but, but I think it's another note from Jules. What's that? Oh, cool. Revolver ammo. Pills. All that for that. Oops. Okay. Man, that storm is crazy. There's something in there? Hold on, I just want to take a look real quick. No. Thought it was pills, maybe, but it's not. Oh well. Alright. Doing a little bit of exploring while I make my way there. Shit is intense, man. I would not want to be here. God. Terrifying. Of course. Shit. Yeah. Nope. Fucking sucks, dude. It's a pretty long swim, too. Oops. Forgot about these damn waves. Ugh. 
should not look out that way. Oh, no. Be something in these boats, right? No. Looking around. I go in here. This is no point. So crazy to be in something like this. Coming and I hate it. Shit. Gotta be another way. Yeah, no. It's like, I knew it was a vent or something, but... Damn it. Thank you, Ellie. Uh, so fucking sad, dude.
Not a dog bed and everything. Damn Ellie. Owen Moore. Owen. <laughs> really? Let's see what she said. Damn, was there more than that? I feel like I missed so much. Oops. Tell me where she went. How do we know you won't kill us? We'll give her what she wants and we're dead. You guys can survive this. I just need her. Bullshit. You. Come here. Fucking get over here! to where she is on this map and then you it better fucking match up okay what are you doing she's probably dead anyway it is not worth it stop we can talk Wake about the it. fuck up point to where she is God damn it, Ellie. So fuck, dude. Oh, listen for this. Tell me this doesn't sound like somebody. Talk about that at the end, though. Damn, man, if only they like grab the map, too. <laughs> uh, so many mistakes.
time we get there, this whole area will be thawed. Where are you going? Needed some air. What are you guys doing up? Couldn't sleep. Come take a look at this. Thought is to head home via Ellensburg. If we can fall city by tomorrow, we're doing good. Hey. They got what they deserved. But she gets to live. Is that okay? It has to be. Mm. I'm really not looking forward to going through Idaho again. Mm, what you should be worried about is what Maria's gonna do to you when we get home. <laughs> We've been through worse. <laughs> However, as I was passing through some ritzy section of town, come across this necklace. It sparkles a lot. I think it's real gold. You think it's real gold? <laughs> it's real gold. Let's see it. <laughs> I know what gold looks like. <laughs> if it's legit, can we say it's from all of us? <laughs> you find your own damn bribes. How you doing? Fine. Ellie? Fine. <sighs> Thanks for coming back for me. My friend's problems are my problems. <laughs> You're such a sap. All right, how about it? My friends can't get out of their own damn way. It's better. Shit! Jesse! Stand up! Hands in the air, I shoot this one too! Don't you do it, Ellie! Get out of here! Stand up! Now! Don't you fucking dare! Shut the fuck up! Toss your weapon. Toss your weapon! Fuck! No, no. I know why you killed Joel. He did what he did to save me. There is no cure because of me. I am the one that you want. Just let him go. You killed my friends. We let you both live. And you wasted it! It's fucked up. <laughs> Dad? 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 Come on. Alright, so I'm going to leave off. I totally get why people were, were pissed off about this, but, like, even I was. Like, I was, like, what the fuck? But I was so curious as to, like, to hear her side. It's just, it, it is really fucked up to leave <laughs> that moment in a cliffhanger to go back. It's crazy, but it's, it's, it's pretty bold, honestly. But yeah, what a what a crazy sequence. Just losing Jesse and everything. Uh, the the Mel and Owen thing. Um, oh yeah, I wanted to mention that I, I I haven't really seen any other people talk about this, but after Ellie kills Mel and Owen and she goes back to Mel's body and she goes into that like sh shell shocked state, her ears are ringing, all that stuff. That's not Tommy that she hears. That's Joel. You can hear the difference in tone in their voices. Maybe it's obvious. I just 
haven't really seen people talk about this like anywhere <laughs> and I, I, f I feel like it kind of goes back to like the moment she killed david in the first game and she's kind of expecting joel to come and comfort her obviously he's not but it's Tommy. I just want to say that because I really don't know. Like, I, f I really feel like people haven't really noticed that or th or they have never said anything about it. I Because like I said, I have not seen anybody talk about it. I've listened to podcasts about it and I've heard nobody talk about it. And yeah, just nothing. But I just wanted to share that. So yeah, I guess let me know what you, th you think or if you notice that or yeah, just let me know. Uh, down below. I hope you're enjoying the playthrough. If you are, please leave a like and subscribe. And yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.